Hello, 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 beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new leagues video. And in the last video, we got pretty spooned at TOA, but we also ended up doing a bunch of necks and a ton of other things. So in this episode, we will work with a fine balance of obtaining points, working towards maxing, but also getting more PVM drops. So, without further ado, let's jump right into today's episode. I think I will start today by just finishing my Abyssal Demon task. Now, there are tasks for Sire as well, but I'm not feeling it at the moment. And also, I just want to stack a little bit more Heart Clues and Elite Clues. Because a couple of hours from now, there's going to be a patch where I really hope that they will make every Elite, every Heart completable in an area. So that's what I'm aiming towards, and I just want to stack a few clues. Dude, <clears throat> I nearly got one hit by a greater abyssal demon. Look, I'm 20 HP because I was just praying annihilate and let's just say he annihilated me. All right, we got a whip and an elite from a superior actually. Another whip, another superior and we get nothing. Well, elite, another whip, another whip. Oh, nice. There we go. No deaths, 300. Uh, my first 300 duo. Okay, let's take a look. Can we get another Mazori piece? That would be absolutely phenomenal for the account. Ah, oh, unlucky. We get Emerald, Gold Bars, and Lily of the Sands. Okay. Nice. My first ever 500 invocation. Whoo. Sick, dude. And it was a duo as well, and I think I did pretty well. I'm not even gonna lie. There's a bunch of combat achievements. Okay. Ah, oh, let's see if it's also a purple. Oh, yeah, it's also a purple. I don't know if it's mine or his. Okay, but it's his, I guess, right? Yeah. Okay, let's see. Good luck. Ooh, 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 ooh. What does he get? Oh, another one. I think that's like fourth. <laughs> he has so many of these. <laughs> Lol. No way, bro. No way. Let's see what do we get. Wait, what are all these items? Mazori crafting kit. Mana fight ornament kit. Cursed phalanx. I don't know what any of this does. Okay, so apparently with one of these kits, I can make a nice assembler. Maybe this one. A needle is required to work with this crafting kit. All right, let's go ahead and uh, grab a needle real quick. Oh, this is kind of exciting, I think. So let's use the needle on, no, let's use this on this. Oi, there it is. There's Osmotan Fang on the floor. He's dropping all the Osmotan Fangs, but. Oi, oi, oi. And now we can wear it. And it's a plus 200. Oh, shit. And let's see how it looks. Ooh, looking good. Now we just need Mazori body and legs. Nice. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, be purple. Be purple, be... Ah, it's him again! He even died! No! It is disaster. It's fine. Ah, uh, let's see what he gets. He doesn't want another fang. Oh, that would have been perfect! Nine! No! This is disaster! Ouch! <laughs> Great. Okay, TOA, we got back-to-back -back purples, now we're coming to Nex, let's see if we get something at Nex. Starting off with some prayer pots and death rune. We're doing duos, by the way. Dude, there's nothing more satisfying than double 100 ruby specs, like, that's so crazy. Okay, good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck. Coal and ruby, how much coal is that? 1.3 thousand? And also 62 rubies is great. Uh, nice crafting XP there as well. Okay, okay, okay. Good luck. Not the best. Uh oh. Uh, do I try to solo next? Like completely solo. I'll try it. I think I can do it with my relics and the amount of food. I mean, it seems pretty doable so far to solo. The only downside is I'm using quite a lot of uh, supplies. I guess this is now the hard part. Okay, let's see if I can do it. 1000 HP. I mean, so far it seems like I could comfortably solo next. The only problem is it's uh, 
very long kill and a lot of supplies. But this is the second time I've basically fully soloed it. I mean, this this time it died on like the first phase, so... Let's take a look. This is an extremely high chance for an item right here. And there it is, another solo next defeated. Last time we got the Torva plate body, this time we get nothing. Okay, let's see. Good luck. Nothing. Lots of brews though. 10 brews, 10 restores is uh, actually pretty alright. Oh, double 100 again. I love it. Okay, good luck. Come on. Oh, man. Uh, Wine of Zamorak though. Pretty decent for... what? Well, I have no ranging potions at the moment, so... Yeah, I'm coping. I'm coping. 81 KC though. Oh, there it is. 100, 100. Half of the HP just gone. Okay, this is it. This is it. This is it. Come on. Just death runes. Oi, oi, oi. Okay, come on. Yeah, I'll, I'll take the rubies, but... Ah, come on, man. Just give me the drop. Anka diamonds and coins on KC84. KC, I don't know how much. Let's see. A runeite ore, 53 of them. And we got a bunch of fire rune as well. But KC85, we're going up in the world. This is a quick reminder to let you know that if you are enjoying leagues, you should probably subscribe. Just got Ancients and Ammonian gloves from this dude. I think that's the second piece of that actually. But I didn't know you can get it from here and I can't fucking move and now I'm gonna get stunned and I I I. Yes, okay, good. We get a lot of Nihil shards, 47. At least we get this. This is a good drop. I need 250 of these in total. So then when I get my bow, I can actually make it. I think he went out. Yeah, okay. The Nihil stack is moving up to over 120 right now. Pretty solid. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try to do this one time, see how it goes. That's kind of nice, actually. Oh, and we get Onyx bolts. Nice. Lots of restores, lots of brews, some vines of Zami, but nothing what we need. Maybe the solution to get the drops at next is to not expect the drops. You know, 90 KC, one drop so far, it's a bit bad, but... Uh, we're getting MVP every single duo as well, which is uh, really, really nice. We just need to keep grinding. At some point it's gonna drop, but I should have seen a lot more drops. This is like really unlucky with the 5x multiplier. Anka Diamond, 40. Water Rune, 8.8k. Cannonballs and prayer potions. Man, I really feel like we should get... We did so many duos and we got absolutely nothing to show for it. Okay, after this one I'm taking a bit of a break because I've been at this for many, many hours today. So maybe we finish this solo and we get a drop. That would be a great way to end it. Let's take a look at another solo next. If anything, bro, come on. Come on, dude. Come on, come on, come on. Please. Man. Okay, well, at least we clutched it. 93 KC. Apparently, I also got Ancient Ceremonial something. Oh my god, I turned recorder on, I almost die. Good. That's the third piece. I, again, I have no idea if there is a quest with this or a task with this, but it's a third drop. I'll take it, I guess. KC 94, we get some prayer potions, some soul runes. Kill count 95, we get a bruise, a rubies, and restores again. Again, supplies. And blood runes. We are once again alone. My buddy died. He did not survive the shadow. Uh, I'll do one more solo and then um, my supplies are probably gonna start to look a bit sus, not gonna lie. I mean, we're down to only 300 karams. I mean, I have a thing like 10,000, but I just don't want to cook them. Double 100 on a solo is so satisfying. All right, there we go. Another solo. This is the best chance we're gonna have. And we get an ancient hilt. No way. We got something. I don't... Uh, it's, not the, it's not the best, but at least I got something. I will take it. Thank you, game. Oh my god, I've been doing this the whole day, man. I mean, what it feels like the whole day. It wasn't the whole day, but you get the idea. Luckily, we already have a God Sword Blade, so I can just put Ancient Hilt on it, equip it. It's not even a task. Ah, how is this not a task? Maybe I need to spec it. Hold up. No, 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 there is no way this is not a task hold up. Like, what? <laughs> I was hoping. I was hoping there was at least like spec or something with it. Well, all these hours of next, I'm out of prayer potions. But I do have a hundred renards. I don't really know from where. So uh, we are now a proud picker of the snape grass. I need a hundred of these. 
Well, I just wanted to do some random task and I decided to mine some gems and uh, there's 2000 total. Got a mining level out of that one. I'm just trying to get opal so I make an amulet. I think it's opal. So I make an amulet so then I can train my herbler and have the amulet equipped and I think that's a task. I don't really know why I'm doing it right now. I'm about to do TOA. I ran out of prayer potions. I was gonna just train herbler. Now I'm mining. What the fuck am I doing? Hey, make 30 prayer potions. Uh, I don't know why, but my amulet isn't really giving me any bonuses. That's another thing that I wanted to do. Uh, but yeah, just stacking on as many prayer pots as possible right now. Then we do some TOA. It's gonna be sick. Ah, there we go. Make a Fordos potion. So you can only do that whilst having amulet of chemistry on you, I think. Wait, what is this? Did I just not loot this last time? Wait, did I do a run and forgot to loot? What is this? 1300 bloods. That's amazing. Ooh, I just completed combat achievement heart tier. Because I just did a perfect Zebak. Nice. Please, I want to see a purple, man. That was 500 as well. Oh, oh my god, we got a purple. Dude, let's go. Mazori, please. Mazori, please. Just not hit. Not hit and we're happy. Ooh, here we go. I guess anything that's not a Mazori mask, I'll be okay with. And no ring, please. Oh, I got the ring. Oh, no. I got the light better. Uh, maybe it's a task. Wear it. Ah, it is at least a task, so not too bad. I don't really think I'll be using it, but I will take it. Nice. 12.2, not the best run from me. Uh, but let's see if we can get it back to back. Another 500 invocation. Another purple. I don't know if it's mine. It shows open. Is that mine? Or his? I guess it's his. Okay, I don't know how you can check if it whose it is, but let's see. What does he get? I've seen him get two fangs already. Ooh, Mazori mask. He got a body, now he has Mazori mask. Nice. Oh, I guess he already has it. Not nice. Ooh, 60 dragon stones. Little bit of mahogany logs as well. That's pretty nice, honestly. That's pretty nice. I have been PVMing the whole day. So right now... I think I'll just go chill a bit. Maybe I'll cook some of my Karambo ones because uh, I only have 200 left and I think I have a bunch in my bank. So I think that's what I'm going to do just to chill a little bit, wind down. And uh, what does the gluten mean? Ate the most food. <laughs> but he's the leech, I'm the gluten though. God damn. Hey, there we go. 25 million cooking XP. I quickly decided to cook exactly 3918 Karam ones. Still have a bunch more. And uh, well, the main reason for that is I can now use this whilst PVMing. And every time I run out of them, I'm just gonna grab another batch and get another 12 point something mil XP and then do it all over again the next time I need them. Dude, I've set up a bank. Oh my. Dude, I don't believe it, because I've set up a bank pin at the start of leagues, right? And I cannot remember it. It should be this, because this is the pin on my account. And I can't get in. Please wait 10 minutes before starting again. I cannot fucking play leagues right now, because they force you to put the bank pin on because of the event. I put the bank pin on, and now the bank pin doesn't work. I'm fucked. Attempt number two of trying to get into my account. I'm just gonna start fucking writing it down, like, this is my standard, and it doesn't get me in, that's horrible. Okay, what about this one? Bro, that's horrible. I'm not gonna lie, that is horrible feeling. You know it's bad when I start running agility laps, man. I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do, I'm just running laps. Luckily I have birds <laughs> nest and fairy mushrooms, so maybe we do like a ultimate series. I'll have to like farm my... I don't know, bro, this is horrible, man. Dude, I just went through literally four stages of grief and I just full yolo the random thing and I think it worked. I don't want to have a bank pin, bro. This was too much stress. At least I got in. Oh, my. All right, that was stressful, but we can play normally again, so I don't need to do agility. I just came back to finish up this 85. That stressed me out, like, more than you guys can imagine. If I was locked out of the account for three days, it would be... 
Pretty devastating, pretty devastating to say the least, but we got 30 minutes until the system update and I do believe they're giga buffing clue scrolls, as in, they're making the clue scrolls completable in your region. But, whilst we're waiting for these 30 minutes, I'm just gonna do some chill relaxing Slayer, I know for a fact I have a Kurask task, I still need to leave Bladed Battle Axe, and I want to get my Slayer up to the point where I can kill Cerberus, because that's gonna be huge for our account, because we have all three different variants of boots, and we could start upgrading them. So, yeah, let's grab our broad bolts. I always forget this when I'm on a Kurask task. We grab this, we go kill some, see if we get lucky. We got superior Kurask. And we get a rune longsword. And a clue scroll. Another king Kurask. I really hope I get a heart one of these days. A uh, bunch of herbs. The patch is here, and I'm doing clue scrolls. I'm gonna start with some elites, some hearts. I have a lot of these, so... But first thing I wanna do is actually get a strength cape. So I have a teleport to this area a little bit easier. So now I have a pretty convenient teleport right over here to the Warriors Guild. Somewhat close to the bank, but most importantly, it's just in this general area. There's quite a lot of clues that send you either to Dunstan or somewhere up here, so uh, or Warriors Guild. So this is just helpful in general. The second thing that's gonna help us speed up these clue scrolls is by having access to glory teleports. So I can build a quest hall, go to the guild trophy place, and I should be able to build a... Emerald of Glory, however money is charged, so let's just uh, go around the game first three times and then we build it afterwards. That is Amulet of Glory in the house completed. It is actually amazing, there is so many people doing clue scrolls right now because you can complete every single step. A part of the elite uh, that requires me to quest right now, which I really don't want to do, but I'll do it later, it's Spirit of the Elite or whatever. For now, I think we're gonna open like 10 hard clues at a time. Uh, and see if we get something cool from it. I will probably be doing some more clues, so I'm not gonna be banking my inventory, but let's start with one elite and ten hearts. So, elite, another rune crossbow, interesting. Obviously, we don't need this. Then hearts, we're really looking for any sort of collection log slots, is what I'm thinking. Wait, they fixed it. I got a master casket from doing this elite. They fixed it in today's patch, let's take a look. There we go, Master Clue completed, we got a Dragon Plate Body Ornament Kit, can't be using that unfortunately, and a Dragon Halberd, which I probably can't wear, yeah, because I need Regicide. No, I got another Master, is it bugged again? It's not bugged again, okay. I was scared for a second that it was bugged again, we got Samurai Gloves, Samurai Gloves, Rope Top of Darkness, and a bunch of Onyx Bolts. That is actually really good. Oh, and the Dragon Scimitar, which let me guess, I can't wield it. Yeah, uh, let's go ahead and Alg this, and uh, yo, that's pretty good though. I got scared for a second. In the start of the league, there was a bug where when you open the clue scroll, it like kept duplicating over and over and over again. But I just got lucky for a double master there, so that's uh, that's pretty awesome. But obviously, we got 10 hearts that can also turn into elites. Oi, oi, oi. We got a Dual Psy, Gothic's High Boots, Bandos Coif. That is pretty solid. What we're looking for is all the god dehyde, but they need to be in the same style. So the same, the same god variant, right? So there's gain 50 uniques for 200 points. We also got an amulet of glory. That's pretty cool. Amulet of glory T. Nice. Wait, but I still have 10 clue scrolls. So I opened them, but only zero of them went down. This didn't go down again. How high is the likelihood? There's an enchanted rope top, 200 collection lock completed. Very beautiful. Now it went down there. Okay, so now this is actually working as intended. Finally, the clue relic is absolutely insane right now. Okay, we got nine more. Start off with an ancient plate body, ancient dehyde boots as well. Moving on to a master cask, it's very good. And we got bandos chaps, maybe that's what we need. We'll take a look. Okay, we got zami bracers, pretty solid. Uh, nothing in the next one. Gothic stole, nothing crazy in this one. We still have five more though. Bandos Dehyde Shield, wait, that's pretty solid. That's my best shield, I think. That is extremely good with my range setup. I've just been using a rune shield this whole time, but now Bandos Dehyde Shield is actually a pretty solid upgrade. Ken, we have five more hard clue scrolls. This is just non-stop pop-ups right now. Uh, nothing in this one, just a Cavalier. Arma Bracers, that's probably new. Another enchanted top and a page. We need more of these pages. Very cool, but uh, just a couple of collection logs. We got Sarah Dehyde boots as well. Not bad. And the last one, do we get a bonus? We do not get a bonus, but we get another Amulet of Glory, another Rune Cane. Okay, that is pretty cool. I'm gonna do more clue scrolls because the loot seems very decent right now.
Looks like for my master casket, I will need to get another fire cape very quickly. I'll do this at some point, I'm sure. All right, I decided to do 10 more hard clue scrolls to finish off the video, and I can 100% guarantee I'll be doing a lot more of these in the future videos, but uh, let's jump right into it. Start off with no uniques, and we have 37 hard clues completed. Ooh, Robin Hood hat. That is cool. Obviously, right now we have Mazori mask, so it's not very, uh, let's say, useful anymore. But that is a cool drop to get. And we still got eight more. Uh, let's take a look. We got Bandos, Plate Legs, Rune Defender Ornament Kit. We got Rune Dehyde Chaps as well. Pretty nice. Are these super restores on the same drop chance as a third age? Don't tell me. I think that might be the same drop chance as third age. And this makes me a little bit upset. But anyways, we got seven more. Start off with no uniques. Moving on to a Bandos, Koif, and Narda teleport. This can actually be pretty useful, I think, for some situations. We'll take it. This might be it. This might actually be it. We got, ooh, Gothics, Gothics, Arma here. Let's take a look. I do believe I should have... Never mind, it's not it. Damn it. I need Gothics, Chaps. What about Arma? Ooh, okay, I'm missing Arma, Koif, I think, because this one's Bandos. So close to finishing another task, but I'm just a little bit off it right now. Anyways, we got uh, five left. What do we got? Bandos, Dehyde Boots. More uniques there. Maybe I have Bandos completed now, who knows. Another Enchanted. Now we pull another Heraldic Shield with a Bandos Plate Skirt. And here we pull a Sara Page with another Gothic's Dehyde Boots and Gothic's Plate Body. This one is not the best. And the last chest of the video. Let's take a look. Ooh, Armadihide Boots. Was that what we needed? I think not, but pretty fun. Like so many tasks and collection logs completed. I guess, let's take a look. Armadil one, two, oh, wait, wait. We did it, I think. Let's see if this is a task. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I'm missing the coif. Ah, it's a disaster. Close, <laughs> close, but not quite. Still, we are going to be doing a lot more clues in the future because I absolutely enjoy how fast, well, they're not that fast, but they are pretty fast to complete and you can stack them and I have a lot of them. So looking forward to it. But as always, as you guys know, if you enjoyed today's video, do consider leaving a comment, maybe a like on the video and do check if you're subscribed to the channel. We're trying to post every single day. A lot of league stuff is happening right now. So I would really appreciate it if you guys can help me out in return as well. That being said, I'm most likely going to be back with you tomorrow. Be safe and bye-bye.